Deuce Leaf, you know what I'm saying? Brat, you dig what I'm saying? 405 representer, OKC, for y'all that don't know, you know what I'm saying? Champagne winner, you dig what I'm talking about? I ain't never been a beginner, new, I ain't new to this shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm true to this shit, blue flame in this shit, blue flame in this bitch, brat, woo! You dig what I'm saying? What up, my nigga Shizzle? What up, motherfucking Y Jizzle? What up, TZ? What up, all you motherfuckers? What up, Tweet G? What up, Pete? What up, motherfucking DC? What up, Steve? What up, L? What up, motherfucking all y'all niggas, man? You dig what I'm saying? What up, Dro? God damn it. What up, A Rock? God damn it. You know what I'm saying? What up, uh, motherfucking and your birthday tomorrow? You dig what I'm saying? Mr. Smooth, Mr. Smooth Romeo. Yeah, I saw that shit. Oh, look at your birthday tomorrow. Ain't this not a bitch dress hanging longer than motherfucking grandma's titties, nigga. That's what's happening though, you dig what I'm saying? That's some play ass shit, nigga. I hope you ballin', throwing champagne up and doing whatever it is, aka I know you ain't doing none of that shit. So I'ma do it for you. You dig? But yeah, you dig what I'm saying? We just here getting our represent on, sitting up a motherfucking P10 Nepper, you know what I'm saying? Getting it in, how we getting it in, you know what I'm saying? I ain't really counting no paper right now, we just chilling, sipping on some Svetica, like a Russian. You know what I'm saying? Cause a nigga might rush you. You know what I'm saying? Nigga might touch her, nigga might hush her. Ain't really up for all them games and shit though, you dig what I'm talking about. Came here, politicking, trying to figure out, you know what I'm saying, what I want to do for this bio. I don't really know, you know what I'm saying? Just winging this shit, you dig? Ain't trying to really put on no front. Ain't trying to motherfucking get on no, yeah, flash, flash, da 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 da. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's cool to be in front of the camera, you know what I'm saying? But I ain't really on that shit. Saying. That's the weirdest thing about me. That's that's the most fucked up thing about me is goddammit. I don't even really want to be seen, you know what I'm saying? I just want the fucking bread and I want the masses to hear what I got to say, you know what I'm saying? Fuck all that bling bling shit, even though I like wearing jewelry, you know what I'm saying? Even though I come through flash and you want to shut it down every now and then. But you know what I'm saying? Majority of the time I stay humble, you know what I'm saying? A bumble like a bee. Bow! <laughs> you dig? Shit, we just in this motherfucking politicking, like I said before. You dig what I'm saying? Doing my thing, just got motherfucking dreads laid. It's all good. Born and raised in the 405 to OKC, you dig what I'm talking about? Been, you know what I'm saying? Been there all day, every day. You know what I'm saying? The panhandle is where I'm lay, you dig what I'm talking about? You know what I'm saying? But I currently reside, you know what I'm saying? The majority of the people you dig what I'm talking about around here know me. You know what I'm saying? I've been here since 9 8 doing my damn thing, you know what I'm saying, I know my heart is in the 405, you know what I'm saying, I gave a portion of my heart to these streets over here, in the 217, big up the Midwest, much love. Well, to be honest, um, I never really, I mean, as I was a show, you dig what I'm saying, I was always uh, into music, into dancing, into entertaining for the family, you dig what I'm saying, so... We had family gatherings and shit. You know, I come out, break into my little hammer dance. You know what I'm saying? Ain't, ain't gonna front. Nigga bust a hammer. You know what I'm saying? Big ups to hammer, nigga. You know, you know you was doing that shit. And a lot of you motherfuckers know that y'all was bagging that shit too. But I always been entertaining, you know what I'm saying? Since I was a motherfucking showy. You know what I'm saying? I love the shit out of hip hop all day. But I love the shit out of R&B too. You know what I'm saying? And until, the, until like I was 12, I'll never forget it because I was 12 years old. And... I was at the crib, you know what I'm saying? I was chilling up in Vegas and shit. That's where I resided at the time. And um, I was watching Teen Summit, for y'all that don't know. You know what I'm saying? It was a positive influence. It was a positive uh, program that was on BET along uh, uh, back in the days. And they just always had these old cool ass topics that they was talking about. And this, in particular time, they was talking about, you know what I'm saying, goals and being all that you can be. And you know what I'm saying, some old cool inspirational shit. And I really wasn't tripping. You know, because I was just chilling, you know what I'm saying? Chilling at the crib, but um, I just heard some powerful words. I forgot who actually was saying those, but, you know, they had spoke about, you know, doing their thing and just it just basically starting somewhere and becoming who you want to be. And for some odd reason, I was like, you know what I'm saying? I really do like rapping, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I can blow, you know what I'm saying, on, on the R&B side, you know what I'm saying? That's cool, but I wonder, I've always been interested in rappers, rappers and all that good shit, so... You know what I'm saying? I'll never forget that that was the day that I decided that from that day on, the 
that I was going to rap because I didn't know how to rap at all. I didn't know how to write. I didn't know shit as far as the concept. I thought everything was so fucking hard. You know what I'm saying? I never really understood how they, how a motherfucker can write 16 bars. Then I never understood how a motherfucker can write three of those bars to make one song. Then I never understood how a motherfucker could write 12 of those because at the time they was only really probably supplying like 12 tracks on a tape. You dig what I'm saying? So I never really understood how a motherfucker could spit, have that much to say, and it not be repetitive. So at that moment, I never forget it. That's when I decided that I was going to step into the situation and become the individual that I am today. Uh, a lot of people influenced it, you know what I'm saying? Just to name a few, because, you know what I'm saying, born and raised in the 405, you know what I'm saying? We listen to a lot of West Coast music, so we got E-40, you know what I'm saying, Too Short, Spice One, MCA, motherfucking, uh, shit, <clears throat> you know, Wolf Pac, you know what I'm saying, of course, uh, I listen to Biggie, you know what I'm saying, I listen to Nas, listen to Wu-Tang, listen to, you know what I'm saying, a lot of cats, I listen to a lot of shit, you know what I'm saying, Heavy D, you know what I'm saying, Mother Shot, that nigga, you know what I'm saying, Special Ed, that was my motherfucker, be nice, you know what I'm saying, Big Daddy Kane, I always want to be like that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying, with two black ass niggas, um, just a lot of people, you dig what I'm saying, really influence the way that I rap, and I just kind of never, I'm sorry, and I got to give it up to Sebo, god damn it, from Brother Lich Hung, you dig what I'm saying, that whole, that whole Seawall crew to my niggas, you know what I'm saying, that's some shit, Spice One, I mean, I already said Spice, you know what I'm saying, Yuck Measy, Face, you know what I'm saying, all them niggas, you know what I'm saying, really was banging that shit, the whole Swab House, you know what I'm saying, whole rap alive motherfuckers was on all that shit, you know what I'm saying, Sick Witty Records, all them niggas, you know what I'm saying, but, just everybody played a, a, a part, you know what I'm saying, in my creativity because at the time, you know what I'm saying, to be honest, a lot of people, it was it was more to offer to the rap game. Right now, the shit is whack, you know what I'm saying? Whoever take offense to that shit, fuck you, nigga. I really don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? We can, we can take care of that shit in person, or we can take care of that shit, got David in the booth, you know what I'm saying? However you feel, you know what I'm saying? That's on you. But you know what I'm saying? When I, you know what I'm saying, we talk about 12 and, and on up to a certain extent, goddammit. A lot of motherfuckers was just rapping to be rapping, you know what I'm saying? The bread wasn't there, it wasn't about all this, about all that. Motherfuckers was, they had their own individuality, you know what I'm saying? So I had a lot of people, I had more influ I had more people to influence me to put me in the right direction versus right now, I would give the majority of these motherfuckers. There's only a small percentage of these individuals that I would consider, you know what I'm saying? I in competition, you know what I'm saying? But. I just feel like, you know what I'm saying, a lot of these cats are neglected as far as the youth because they listen to the bullshit, but that's just an opinion, but whatever. If you want to you wanna challenge that, just let me know. I just put it like this. I put it like this, you know what I'm saying? I, I really won't put no names out there, you dig know what I'm saying, because, you know what I'm saying, I just, I just won't, you know what I'm saying? I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that. I'm not going to do it now, and I pray to God that I won't do it, you dig know what I'm saying, once my foot is in the door. It just depends on why you fucking piss me off. But as far as right now, any motherfucker that just that that that's just out to motherfucking be like somebody else, that's not trying to set their own standards and make they and pave their own way, but just trying to get the little deal, get the little bread, get in, get out, and you know what I'm saying? Always got a little motherfucking chuck and jive, chuck and jive, sandman ass shuffle dance to their songs. What the fuck have I? I don't need to dance while I'm rapping. I'm too busy rapping. God damn it, I don't need no, I don't need all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Some shit is cool, some shit ain't. I don't need no bubble gum shit. I don't need no fake ass shit. Motherfucker, if you talking about trapping and you ain't trapping, god damn it, it's a problem. And if right now you felt that in your soul, then I'm talking to you. That goes to the masses. You know what I'm saying? If your, if your heart fluttered, <laughs> Because you were flattered when I said that fucked up ass comment. That's who I'm talking to. Ain't just motherfuckers who just ain't really them on some Millie Vanilli shit. Or ain't right they, they shit. But that's just some other shit.